It is the newest trend for people who get into a fender bender, snap a photo, send it to your insurance carrier, get a check in the mail. But along with that convenience come some potential pitfalls. As Seven on Your Side senior investigative reporter Lisa Fletcher shows us, those photo estimates could put a dent in your wallet. There are roughly 16,000 car crashes in the U.S. every day. To speed up the claims process, many insurers are turning to photo estimating tools. Snap some pictures, upload, and a check will be on the way. They're virtually always low because it, it's just something missed. You couldn't know the cost of the damage from one photo, from several photos, anything like that. Tim Fleming's operated his auto body shop for nearly two decades. Uh, we're busy year round. He says it's tempting for folks with a fender bender to cash the check they get from the photo estimate and forego the fix. Somebody thinks it's not so bad and it turns into a whole lot worse. Fleming says what the photos don't show won't be covered in that initial check. This is the type of damage that you won't see in a picture. It's going to be covered by the headlight or the fender, but you have parts in here that are relatively expensive that are going to need a lot of work done. Money for that comes from what's called a supplemental claim, filed by the repair shop once the car is taken apart. But if you don't know that, you might be shortchanging yourself. Consumers are concerned about the process of whether the estimates they're getting or the checks they're receiving are enough to cover the actual damage. John Townsend is the head of government and public affairs for AAA. He helps consumers avoid the very pitfall to which he almost fell victim after a taxi cab rear-ended him. Townsend sent photos of the damage to the taxi cab's insurer. In return, he got a document to sign. Once you sign it, they send you the check and they have the specified dollar amount. And then it says you can never again make any more claims. The check was for $1,500. So I realized they were exploiting me. Turns out Townsend's repairs will be closer to $3,000. Even if you think it seems about right, you should be very leery of it. We had a, a gal come in who was the middle car of a three-car accident. The insurance company sent her a check for 400 and some odd dollars because her pictures looked like there was just a little bit of damage to each bumper. It turned into over a $4,000 estimate. When it comes to insurance claims, let the insurer be aware of the tricks that can be played on you. Townsend says if the accident is someone else's fault, definitely get your insurance carrier involved and let them fight any battles for you. Lisa Fletcher, ABC7 News.